Joe, this is Gary, and we're examining your block, and um, we're going to video it as we do it. Mm -hmm. This is Gary. And I just mentioned to him the honing that I thought was pitiful, and then also you got some pretty good streaks in there. Well, there's no broken rings when it came out. No, we're not quite. I don't know where the streaks came from. Looks like it. Either pistons were really rough to start with, or there was a lot of dirt. Well, uh, also you've got assembly. serious pitting, uh, rust pitting. Oh, okay. Now well, that cap right there, I don't know if he can see that, but this cap's got a misalignment to it. And cap is offset from one side to the other and this is the cap that came on the block this is not the cap that goes with this block the machine marks don't line up these caps on the ends the parting lines line up fairly close close enough and the machine marks line up for the most part that I can believe that this front rear and rear cap are the originals on the motor you can see like that part, that line right there you look for machine mark lines to line up so you can and your parting lines to line up anyway we're going to get this cap off that's the wrong cap well also you said it had looked like it had spun inside it, there it has it's had a bearing that has spun in here before that's what all this stuff is that and you see that there's now this looks kind of slick you can see uh, the remnants of machine marks machine lines like in this one you might come at this angle will you can see possibly the mm -hmm. machine mm -hmm. lines here almost looks like tool, okay. tool marks or yeah something. tool marks yeah there you go well you can vaguely see them in this one it's almost like it's been polished a lot in this one here you can see them here in this area right here mm -hmm. and then the rest of this is slick and heavy grooves mm -hmm. and this has had a bang that has spun in it before okay you can see the machine grooves here and you can see they're just gone polished here yeah. okay yeah. and the same on the other caps you can see the machine grooves in so what we're looking for is a cap that the parting lines will line up so what I did was I found two two caps that uh, were not in use, and we're going to see if Gary's asked me to bring some here to see if I can find some that look that work better. further this one as it sat on the block was actually offset enough that it would be difficult to line board and um, make everything work properly so I'm going to stop video and take that off and uh, clean it up and then um, refit it <laughs> 